Hey everyone, welcome to Sakura no Gakko, a Japanese style short horror story. Um, it's supposedly really short, so I'm thinking of playing it, and then if it's like only five minutes or so, I'm gonna put another Japanese themed short story that I found behind it. Uh, I had them both separately for a while, and then I just realized I didn't play them because they were so short, or online it said they were only like five minutes. Um, today I realized, you know what, maybe I should just make a Japanese short story themed episode, so probably Sakura no Gakko first, and then I'll switch to the other one. Uh, we'll get to that in a couple minutes. First, let's check this one out. Is the clock broken? <laughs> it's not moving. <laughs> Looks cute. I like the art style. It's fucking loud though. Aw, super cute. I love this art style. What's gonna happen? Oh, she dozing off. She's a sleepy girl. She's me. Oh, it stopped working. Wait. Did it seriously stop working or... Because it timed it really well with her falling asleep. <laughs> Let me reset it. Tangerine games. Don't crash again though. Maybe I should run it in full screen. If it crashes again, I'll try full screen mode. Or maybe I should try and skip cutscene. Mm, nothing happens. That was that was the whole game. It stopped working. It crashed. Game over. <laughs> so enjoy enjoyed those images. That's it. That's the game. See if it crashes again. So this is like her eyes. She's like falling asleep, little by little. Don't crash. Oh, it's loading this time. Okay. Nice! Okay, so... Oh, that's me. I can walk around, I can even jump. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Eat or interact. I don't know if I need to search the desks or anything. Okay, so a little girl falls asleep and she's in this kind of horror version. Can I read the things on the floor? No. I can crouch. I can run. Whee! I love the camera angles. I mean, she looks very... her animations are pretty crude, but the style that it brings with it is really cool. Should I jump this? Haha! -ha. Take that! Floor. Ah, uh, it's teaching me the mechanics, huh? Oh, something back there. What is it? Is that blood? Or is that Sakura? No, it's, it looks like Sakura. It's a doll? Oh, she has a knife in there? Oh, the desks! They've all been rearranged. Well, goodbye, doll. Japanese schools don't look this nice, though. <laughs> They're all like super old buildings. Should we go down? Yeah, we should go down. Whee! Broke my ankles. Can I get a flashlight? Who be laughing? Can I go in the classrooms? No. I wish she walked a tiny bit slower. Holy fuck, that was huge. That was a huge fucking monster. What? Oh god, he broke the door. Um, anything? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I'm dead. Hey girl, you're me. Guess I can't do anything about it. I hope she wakes up at the end. 
Sakura, sort of. What? Oh, no Sakura. This looks really cool. Caught that monster though. Time to go. There it is. Oh my god. Is it seeing me? I'm crouching. Should I go in here? The fuck is it? <gasps> Jesus. Oh god. Hide in the bathroom. I can't. Hanako? Toilet no Hanako? Genki desu ka? I just asked if she was Hanako from the bathroom. You know that famous. There's someone there. Famous story. Famous school ghost story about the bathroom in the third stall of the girl's bathroom. The girl in the bathroom. Girl, The girl in the girl's bathroom. Third stall on the end or something. You want a flower? She wants a flower, I think. Oh, I can't get past her. Um. Wait, but there's nothing I can do here. Wait, I have not been here. I'm just gonna go around her? Ah, look at that. Found it. Um, and then I, sorry, I didn't finish my thing, but then I said, uh, Oh, Genki this guy is like, how are you? Are you good? <laughs> Girl, I got your thing. Are you happy? Yeah, she happy. Thank you. Nice, I did it. No! No! Fuck, 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 fuck! Shit. Go in there! Uh -huh. Okay. How the hell am I gonna get away from him? He's so tall! Holy shit! Wait. <laughs> what happened to your neck? Am I in the hospital? Did I get knifed by someone? What the fuck? Oh. Holy shit! What? That was really good. That was way better than I expected. Awesome. That really creeped me out. Well, that was Sakura no Gakko. I like the Japanese style. I love the art style, the little cutscenes with the images. Um, the Sakura is like super purple though, but... It could be a little bit more pink. That's my only my only contribution. The Sakura is not pink enough. <laughs> I thought it was great. It played really nicely too. Um, I I the only thing I the only complaint I could have is that I want more. I want I want the game to be way more lengthy. I want it to be at least like an hour, and have you explore the school, go through different uh, classrooms, solve puzzles or something, even just like puzzles on the blackboard that if you solve it, a drawer opens somewhere and you get an item. Something like that is... I feel like if you have the mechanics and you have the whole school worked out like this, it won't be that much extra work to add stuff like that. I mean, I'm of course no game designer, so I wouldn't know, but... I feel like they can easily add onto this and make it more lengthy and... Because it's really good. I thought it was really good. Um, did we look at the credits? Let's let's give it a look. Kenny did three things. Amida did three things. Max, Zach, Nathan, Yilin, 3D artist, Putri. That's it. 
Wow. Good job, guys. That was great. Thank you. Okay, I will now switch to the other one. What the fuck is it called again? After school? Is that what it is? Yeah. So this one's called After School. Give me a second. I need to set it up. And... Ah, there we go. This one's called After School and it's made by the people that made... What was it called? Fuck. Give me one second. I gotta look it up. Okay. The other game I played by them is Yurei Station. And that was a really short uh, story as well about a girl in Japan visiting a shrine. And all I remember is that she met this huge no mask. This guy, actually. Um... She met up with that one, and uh, she had to do something like... Something Japanese. It was really fun, but I played it so long ago I don't remember. I'll link it after the video for sure. It's played in English. <laughs> this one is supposed to be less horror. More just like story with slight creepiness. Oh, look how cute! Every evening, on her way home from school, a girl stops at the window of a boy she loves in secret. So this is all hand-drawn, of course. Um, it's like his little studio that makes these. Her heart swelling with longing, the girl pauses to have a look, maybe, before continuing her walk. Can I walk? Ah! Oh, so cute! It's really cute. I love the watching the train as it slides across the horizon. The girl imagines that perhaps one day the two of them will run away together. Aww, cute. A little Jizo? I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> Am I home? We live that close together? Alone in her room, the girl wonders if tomorrow the boy will finally notice her. Hi, I'm that girl that's been staring creepily in your window every year. Tuesday. Today, the girl considers knocking on the boy's window. Do it! How would he react? But she cannot bring herself to interrupt him. Perhaps when he has finished with his reading. Are we gonna wait? No. I'm gonna have to go. Cute music, too. No, 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 no. When the boy does notice her, they will sit together at the river shore. It won't be- it won't at all be like earlier, when she watched him from a distance. What's that? In the middle of the path, the girl finds three incense sticks. The brand is unfamiliar. Oh. Okay. And let's go home. That's a random thing to find. Not unusual, though. Alone in her room, the girl wonders if tomorrow she, fi she will find the strength to talk to him. Wednesday. Oh, girl. The boy is captivated by his book. For a good long while, the girl watches the boy's fingers brush against the pages before continuing on her walk. On her walk. Damn, this girl. Kind of creepy, though. I wonder if one of them is dead. <laughs> and it's a ghost. Maybe I've just played too much horror. Is the train shorter each time? Earlier today, the boy once again failed to notice her. You can just walk up to him and talk to him. He only had eyes for the book in his hands. Maybe I'm the ghost. What's that? Chocolate? In the middle of the path, the girl finds three matches. The little demon on the box smiles at her with, with a mocking expression. 
Yokai Mechi. Okay. Thursday? Alone in her room. The girl is too sad to dream of tomorrow. Hmm. Thursday. Well, at least tomorrow did come. Today, more than ever, the girl feels this coldness in the window, to the window between them. Maybe he's just pretending not to see her. A strange atmosphere per permeates the air. The girl continues on her walk without lingering. Oh. Damn. Today she's like, okay, I'm done. Let's just go. Watching the train as it slides across the horizon. The girl imagines that one day the boy might leave. And she will never see him again. Hmm. Music was really loud! Oh! The demon on the altar seems to stare at her. Can you use the incense and stuff? Why not, right? Girl makes a wish. I wish he's mine forever. Ah. Walks serenely into the night. Oh, so cool. Yes. So, what happened to her? That's the book he's reading? Is he dreaming about her? Après l'école. After school. Wait! That's it! Fuck. She's just a story in his book. Damn. So it's the dude fantasizing about her life, not the other way around. He's fantasizing, the girl's fantasizing about him. I guess. I, I love the little Japanese touches. I, I also love their work. Yeah, Atelier Sento. They're great. Like, um, some of them have traveled- oh, the game closed. Some of them have traveled to Japan. Most of it is just done by um, looking at pictures of Japan, though, and trying to copy that. Um, I must say, the mountains there looked very much like Kagawa, which is north of here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I, I really like that. It was, a, it was a nice little short experience. I thought these two little short things were great. Um, all in all, it's only a 20 minute video, so it's a really short. But I hope you guys liked it. And um, I'm glad I was able to combine these in like a Japanese themed episode, at least. Lots of Japanese stuff coming up. Lots of Japanese uh, two translated episodes than this one. So I'm pretty happy with that. It's going to be a good Japanese weekend for you guys. Um, but yeah, that's it. Um, I enjoyed them. I thought they were very good. That's about the conclusion of my story. So I hope you guys liked it too. I'll see what else I can find for you and see you there. Thank you. Bye.